guys welcome back to my channel peppermint crinkles this is Anzo. it's my monthly bye bye products for the month of january and february so here are they see i've also written up yeah so anyways let's get started first off two bottles of alcohol um a cotton round another cotton Two wet wipes. You already know by now what I use them for. Um, cleanser from Escanal. Another deodorant from Dove. Um, actually, this completely dried out and evaporated. This is Calgon. Take me away. I love the scent. This is turquoise. I love the citrusy ocean scent of this. I've been looking for this, hunting for this. Hopefully, I would be able to hunt this down. Um, no supplier online, locally, that sells this. So, I bought this actually on a store that sells international products. I was able to get it. It was so expensive. So, yeah. Another is this sparkling guarana by United Cause of Benetton. This was a time when it was on sale, so that's why. Uh, yeah, so that's it. I'll be, I want to use that. I have something for that. Then I was able to use this uh, Olay um, Day Cream. This is my Holy Grail Day Cream. No other. Alright, and then I was able to use this Lovely Me X BB Cream from the face shop and they already discontinued this product which it's so light on me but I love it I love it um, what's, um, what's this oh um actually I didn't use this up this is the Milani Touch Osan problem I accidentally dropped it and it got broken down but I love this as an all-over bronzer yeah finally I was able to use a tub or a jar or what do you call this British Rose from the body shop I love this scent I really love this it has that kind of um, mild rosy scent British English Rose I think yeah, I think it's English rose. They use English rose on this, though I'm not aware, but by the scent of it, it's not like other roses that I actually smell. Like the Ecuadorian rose, I've smelled it. It's not the same as this one. So probably this is the scent of this is like a British rose or an English rose. I don't know, but I love the scent. It's perfect. It's so mild. I bought this when it was on sale. I think 20% discount. So, if ever, but I still have a lot of um, um, a lot of collection of like this. Uh, not this same scent, but different scents. Summer scents, um, limited edition scents like the uh, Christmas and some summer. So and some permanent line. So yeah. If I would be able to finish those, then probably I will buy this next. All right, I want to save the last. And finally, they have changed uh, the, you know, the jar. It's this one. If you seen the previous one on the previous video, that's I hate. Finally, they would they able to you know finally they've listened to their customer complaining about that kind of shape, and it's not worth it. For the uh, for the quantity and the price, but this one for sure is a lot and a ton of products. I was able to use this up for almost more than six to seven months, so it's for the price point. And I was able to buy this 50% 50, 50 off during December sale, and it's worth the buck. I mean, you already use and flexed your. What you bought on this product 
for using this for more than six months and you just only bought this for half a price it's already very 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 worth it okay another one is of course a cotton um okay and then this is uh, Hello Gorgeous Caffeine Eye Serum. It's just an under eye serum. Um, I did add some coffee um, coffee beans on it. Uh, but the truth is, I don't like it. Nothing happened. It's just an almond oil mixed with coffee beans. I just added this coffee beans. Actually, it's just one coffee bean in it. What I did, uh, because in our office there's 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 um brewer i took some and you know crush it down and put it in here to add it more nothing happened with my under eye as in nothing happened it's still dark it's still you know nah, nothing really happened you just waste your money in here even though it's very cheap but nothing happened with me probably it's i do have a very very dark under eye but this can't be so i prefer the garnier one and the maison one yeah and uh this one this is retin a which is a prescription uh it's a pre prescription from doctor from a doctor from a um dermatologist doctor because yeah i'm going to my end of 30 i'm i'm on my last year of 30s so i'm going to my 40s i need of course i need something much more higher form of vitamin c they say sunder sunday riley is is it is a very good retinol thing but it's too expensive um so i try a much more more medicated one which is the retinine one the retin a and it's much cheaper than the sunday riley and then finally i was able for almost I don't know how many months Ooh. I was able to use up and some of it completely dried out this is local wares from Mac as you can see um, yeah as you can see I love it but it completely dried out and even mixed it tried to mix it try to salvage it and yeah look at that can you hear completely dried out but i do love it it's local wares from mac um, it has that kind of green tinge it's a limited edition uh, it's a fluid line so i even i even you know um um put it like this upside down so that it won't dry but quickly dried out so yeah while you're using it it completely dried out but i've never been using that for a lot a couple of months and it's still okay but when i'm using it it's already quickly dried out i don't know what's the logic of that thing but and finally ta -da, i've used up this uh this is maybelline age room and i love 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 this this is my holy grail under eye concealer after um after revlon uh, age defying concealer because it was so expensive even though it's on sale still on sale it's a little bit expensive so i guess nah i'll just find a much more cheaper much more drugstore one yet they have the same function and this is so this becomes my very first i mean this is my the the new holy grail under eye concealer maybelline uh age rewind um i took off i removed the foam because one not hygienic two it absorbs a lot of product so if you don't have any control of putting it on the concealer it will be a ton and it's very hard it takes time to you know blend it out and it will be a waste of money so what i did 
I just took off the sponge and you know the sponge right here and I'll just twist a little bit when there's just a few tiny tiny pea size not a smaller pea size drop and I could you know slowly put on much more tinier drop tinier pea size and that's it so I was able to you know stretch the lifespan of this and it's worth it I was able to really use the um, the it's really hot I'm sorry it's really hot that's why I look at that my makeup is melting I've been wearing my makeup for almost how many hours already I think it's more than eight to ten hours it's really hot it's really hot it's summer here already it's too 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 hot so yeah and of course that's it that's my monthly Bye Bye products for the month of January and February 2019 thank you so much for uh, for for, uh, for watching my video and I hope to see you next time bye